Welcome to our lecture online. Now let's talk about interior versus exterior angles. Now if we simply make a triangle with three sides, you only, you only have interior angles, so this would not apply. But if you take three lines that extend out, and they're not parallel, none of the three lines are parallel to one another, then you form not only a triangle, but the lines keep going, you will also have external angles. So take a look. Here we have three lines. The three lines do form a triangle because none of the none of the lines are parallel to any of the other lines. And so we have three interior angles and of course we already know that the sum of the sum of the measures of those three angles add up to 180 degrees. But notice for every interior angle you'll have two external angles. Two here, two there, and two there. So when you draw a line straight across like that, notice that this angle and this angle together are essentially supplementary angles and they add up to 180 degrees. Again over here you look at these two angles and those are again supplementary angles that add up to 180 degrees. And that will be the case here as well. So these two angles are supplementary, those two angles are supplementary. These two angles are supplementary and those two angles are supplementary. That makes those six angles exterior angles to that particular triangle, but only because the lines extend. If those two lines did not extend past this point, of course, we would not be talking about any external angles. So again, that is a useful thing to know. And in the next video, we'll show you a very special rule, a theorem about exterior angles that comes in really handy sometimes when you try to solve the angles and sides to a triangle. So stay tuned and we'll show you about that particular theorem relative to the external angles of a triangle. I keep saying external. I meant to say exterior angles. Should I do this video over again? Okay. <laughs> All right.